Today I'm going to show you how to fix the uh, no auto run error that's often found in Windows XP and now even in Vista. I got it just a few days ago which prompted me to look for a solution online. I found one that worked for me. The first thing you're going to want to do is go to start or hit the orb if you're on Vista. It's going to be in the same area. You're either going to be typing this into run or into search but it works the same way on either operating system. Type in reg edit and hit enter and if you're on Vista accept it and you'll get something that looks similar to this if not exactly the same. You're going to want to go to HQ local machine then to system then to current control set then to services find CD-ROM helps if you click and hit C it will bring you down to all the C's and right there. Look for auto run. Click it if it's set to zero, you found your problem. Set it to one and restart your machine. Now, that's not all you're going to have to check. There is another problem that could arise. You're going to want to get out of that. You're going to want to go instead, and all under HK Local Machine, you're going to want to go to Software, then to Microsoft, then to Windows. And inside of Windows, you're going to look for current version. Shouldn't be any different than mine, maybe a few fewer folders or perhaps even more. Policies is what you're going to look for next. Right there. And then you're going to want to find Explorer. And in Explorer, you might see well, it's not there for me. But if it's there for you, then you have a problem. No drive auto run. And you're going to want to check in your no drive type auto run. Wait, no, there it is. Never mind. You're going to want to check in here, and you're going to want to make sure it looks exactly like this. Now, wait, you're going to want to make sure this amount has a 9 1 at the end, or in decimal, is set to 1 4 5. If it is set to. B5 or FF, aka it has a 181 in parentheses or a 255 in parentheses, you found your problem. Double click it, set this to decimal, and change it to 145. And then OK it, it'll change, restart your machine, and auto run should work for you. If it still doesn't work, then you have another common or not so common problem. I don't know where in the registry to find this, so I just did a control F and searched the whole registry for it. You're going to type in no drive auto run or no if this finds anything, and for me it won't because I already deleted it delete the key or keys that it comes up with. These are bad. What it, the keys are telling your computer is not to auto run from any of your available USB ports or available CD drives. You don't want that. Once you've deleted that, restart your machine and after that you should have auto run back. 